Hey team, I'm coming to you this morning to share with you another tip to help your business grow. Um, today we're going to talk about Facebook and how to use Facebook to really help your business and um, help it grow, help you learn, and um, just interact with more people so that they see your posts. Um, I have built a lot of my Flexus business on Facebook and so um, it's really easy since it's on my phone and so you can do all of these that I'm going to show you on your phone um, alright so let me pull up my Facebook and I enlarged the um, the screen so that you can sort of see what I'm doing so it's ginormous to me but so hopefully you can actually read it so right now I'm just basically logged in and um, I'm gonna go to my team page this is my big team page some of you may be on Team Eichenhorst. Um, some of you may be on other team pages. But this is my team page for everybody in my downline. So um, one of the really neat things in here is that not aside from, you know, posting and, and interacting with things that um, are being posted is up here these tabs. You have members, events photos in files. So let's say you want a good photo to share. Um, you can go to Google and type in Plexus Fast Relief or Plexus Ease and a lot of photos will pop up and you can save those and share those. But um, a lot of these that anything that has posted in our team page is in here in the photos. So um, sometimes if you're looking for a specific graphic it's already in here so um, you can click on something and then it will not only bring up the photo and you can save it um, to your computer and then share it um, but it also tells you right over here I'm gonna move my little face down here at the bottom it tells you what the post um, was that was attached to that so um, I'm going to show you now the other tab, the most important tab, is the Files tab. In the Files tab, both in my group and Team I can Horst and probably your large team page as well, there are a ton of resources here for you to utilize. And so there are all of these documents that have been created for you for you to use in growing your Plexus business. We have the new Ambassador Guide to Success, Price List, all kinds of things that are also in your back office but in a nice easy place for you to find. So you can scroll through here and see all kinds of things. Um, the biggest thing I want to point out um, is what we always talk about with having emails to send to your customers or somebody that asks you on Facebook what is this Plexus thing. Um, instead of giving too much information in the Plexus um, about Plexus in your Facebook comments, I always say I'll PM you or I'll email you and here are the emails that I send them and you can um, edit them to fit you and put your information in there um, so another thing that is super helpful in the Facebook groups is let's say I am searching for something um, but I don't remember where the post is or sometimes you may be scrolling scrolling and you can't find it so let's say I know it was a Plexus 101 post so I'm going to type in the magnifying glass um, right here Plexus and I'm going to put 101 so then it is going to pop up with everything that has Plexus 101 in it and I can kind of scroll down and see which one I'm looking for maybe you remember it was a specific person that posted this thing. So let's say I know that, oh, my friend Jenny posted something. So I'm going to type in her first name and I'm going to see anything that Jenny posted, either she did or anything that has her name in it. So that is one thing that's really cool too. See, I, in here I tagged her. So anytime it sees a part of the name, it's going to pull it up. So that is super helpful in um, growing your business side and your education for yourself. Um, the other thing that I'm going to show you um, is the health and testimonials page because this is where it's very resourceful. Um, a lot of times I post testimonials on purpose 
meaning I, I post an ADH testimony because maybe I've seen a lot of my friends, um, sorry guys, a lot of my friends posting about ADHD recently. Or maybe I had a specific friend that typed about RA. And so what I do is I come in this testimonial group and I am going to search for ADHD. And it's going to pop up all kinds of testimonials based on ADHD. And so I can kind of look through and browse um, different um, testimonials with ADHD and then I can um, find which one I want and then post it. So that is a life saver instead of trying to find something. Or um, a lot of times we ask for weight gain and so I can type that in and find a testimonial that talks about weight gain whether you have no weight gain or you need weight gain. So that is really cool as well. Um, and then the last thing I'm going to talk about is the fact that on your friends list, a lot of times when you're in Facebook, you scroll down and um, maybe you're only seeing the same group of people in your newsfeed. It's because Facebook tells you what pops up based on who you interact with. So there's, I have over a thousand friends, so a lot of times I only see the same 30 people. So one of the cool things I learned to do is over here on the left, the side, if you scroll down and you see friends, you can come over here and you can create a list. So what I did was I created a list called Nonplexus Peeps, and then I can add my people to this list who I know, um, are um, non-plexus friends and I can add them here so all these people on this list and granted I'm not done adding um, will pop up here so let's say I'm gonna add my friend Lizeth Marino so now she is on here all of her statuses I'm gonna see on here and what I do is every night I go through and I like a few comment uh, pictures or sometimes I'll comment so that way not only am I interacting with them, but they're going to see my post too. And so that is also a really neat thing to grow your Plexus business. So I hope that tutorial really helped you. And I look forward to it growing your business as well.